235610. I'll move that. Which is down 1.13%, moved by Mr. LaBranch, seconded by Regina Barnes. Talk to us. Well, as you can see, um, only there's a few things that did change. Um, the lifeguards are gone out of the budget. That's part of the reason that it's. But there is one change that I did want to discuss a with you. louder so we can hear you. There is one change that I did want to discuss with you. I was um, doing some numbers now that we're toward the end of the year. And this year in my parks budget, parks part of the budget, parks maintenance part of the budget, yeah. I've already spent $17,830. And in this budget coming forward, we had cut some things out and put them in warrant articles. And so my budget now is 13050 And this particular year, even spending this amount of money, I didn't get the uh, playground surfacing that I had put in the budget this year. And I've already spent that part of the budget. So I was hoping that you guys might be interested in um, adding 5000 back into this budget so I won't go over the budget and I can purchase that playground surfacing for the Kids Kingdom and the Toddler Park. What about the 20% that you get from the um, receipts, the parking receipts? Yeah, that's How does that factor in, Diana? That's where some of the things that were taken out of this budget went into, into that 20% warrant article. That's for infrastructure. So this is Fibar, which is the surfacing for the playgrounds, which I've always considered parks maintenance. Mm -hmm. But like I said, I didn't. I wasn't able to purchase it here because we had. We ended up having to make some repairs to a fence that we weren't weren't foreseen. So we had to spend the money there instead of getting the surfacing. Okay, so the first nine months of the year, and this is on the grounds and fields line, right? Yes. Okay, Diana uh, spent nineteen. Uh, was budgeted for nineteen thousand five fifty. She has spent in the first nine months nineteen thousand two sixty two. She requested 18.050, and of course, um, it was dropped down to 13. <coughs> Question? Okay. <coughs> I know that that 20% that you get from the parking lot revenue every year, mm -hmm. you usually have something planned for that. Do you have something planned for it next year? Yeah. What would that We've be? put in um, the items that were cut out of this. And oh my God, I don't have it with me, but no. But usually, I have like a warrant one article. year you did lighting <laughs> for one of the fields. Right. Another time you did the building or something. Yep. Um, so I'm just wondering, if, and, and if the selectman's plan was for you to take some of that money and use it on this this very line item. That's basically my question. Um, Is that their intent? That five grand of that money would be put? Yeah, on? it was for something else that was in this budget, and it went over to that warrant article. The warrant article has about six things in it. I don't have it in front of me. I shouldn't have that. No, but I, I guess the question I'm asking is that, so the warrant article will put that money back in here, correct? Well, it's a separate spending. No, it would be it would be purchasing something else. <coughs> what I'm saying is, no, it no. Are you saying to put it back in the budget? Right. What I'm no. asking. No. Okay, that's okay. That answers my question. Then. Right. So, so what we need is a motion. I'll make a motion to add five thousand dollars back into that line. I'll second. It. By Mr. LeBranch, seconded by Mr. Henderson. Further discussion. What was the line? Beg pardon. We're in the which line? Are you Sixty-five hundred <laughs> under culture and recreation. Grounds and fields under maintenance. Of re recreation. Grounds and fields. Thank you. <coughs> I'm just scared of going over the budget because it's and and I need to purchase that surfacing. So that would change the bottom line to two thousand two hundred and forty thousand. $610. So what does that change the percentage to Instead of being up 1.13%? Yeah. Yes. Again, 3.17. 3.17. Good. That's the answer. 
So that would change the budget committee. That would change the selectmen's um, number from 13050 to 18050 from the budget committee, right? Further questions for Diana? Prepared to vote on the amendment? Have we gotten into that portion where the lifeguards are covered yet? No, no lifeguards. Where are they? No, they're not in this budget anymore. This is separate. Yes, this is separate. We're on the amendment. That was removed from the budget? We're on an you amendment. You can't get lifeguards. We're it's getting removed ready to vote on an amendment. Right. But they've been some, put somewhere else. That's, That's different. Right. That's so, yeah. After yeah. this, we happen to know where they were put. Oh. I do not know. Okay. I know we're trying. Man. Will you still be hiring uh, lifeguards yourself? Point of order. Okay. Point of order. Mr. We have Jones. A, you're not yet charged with that. We have a motion on Mr. the floor. Mr. Jones. You're not yet charged with that. Tim. You're not yet charged with hiring the uh, lifeguard. Someone else is. I don't know. How Mr. Jones, they're in other safety yeah, well, services. We don't need one. The lifeguards are in other safety services. Now. Okay. Thank you. <coughs> yeah. We've got an amendment on the on the floor here. Okay, in favor of the amendment to add the $5,000 to make that line $18,050. Um, okay, um, Brian Russell, Barnes, Gravitz, what are you doing, Brian? No. No, um, Henderson, Pluff, LaRanch, um, yes, <laughs> Lad, <laughs> and Marr, and Augustine. And Wolsey. And Mr. Jones is abstaining? Correct. Mr. Lapham is opposed. 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 Pierce is opposed. Okay. 